Hey guys, and welcome back to Rugby League Live 3B, a pro. As you can tell if you watched last episode, if not, you can watch it. But if you did, it did end with an intense injury. The uh, neck bursitis, neck snap, I don't know, copped a clothesline from the Undertaker and we died. Anyway, put us out for 98 days. We've got almost three and a half months sitting on the sideline doing shit all. Now we're back and we can finally play again in round 19 against the ninth placed Knights. You can see there me going over the menus and the calendar. Looks like our uh, Tigers, not Tigers, sorry, Titans teammates did pretty well to solidify a solid 16th place. I think they did well winning uh, one game of the past, I don't know, 10, 10 plus games they played without me being there. Yeah, it really speaks, uh, speaks a lot about what our team does or how good we are. Doesn't matter too much, it's no real, real bother to me. I probably would have rathered not get into the finals or drag out this first season. I was thinking about trying to like maybe group together matches in episodes just to get it through quicker. Because at the end of um, end of the season here you end up getting contracts. And it'd uh, be nice to move, move somewhere else, hopefully make it outside of the Titans, maybe take my talents abroad if they let me or just uh, dip down south to New South Wales maybe a side down there might want me for the Holden Cup team who knows good to stay in Australia even an NRL team if the uh, proper Titans signed me or um, I'd love to stay in Queensland one of the big three or well, the only three Queensland teams would be nice but doesn't matter yeah no real preference take it over to England would be nice as well or uh, the Q Cup would be nice too. I only like a couple of teams in the Q Cup, mainly if it's Jets and their play style is pretty good, nice under the uh, the coaching of the Walkers brothers there. And uh, yeah, speaking of the Jets, today, or when you're watching this yesterday, was the um, Queensland Cup Grand Final. The Ipswich Jets plays the Townsville Blackhawks. I believe it's the first time the Ipswich Jets have ever won a Grand Final in the Q Cup and a couple of standout names for the Swiss Jets there, Mom and Barber, the brother of Ben Barber. Um, what's our mate? Dummy Half and Matt Purcell, I believe. And uh, Carlin Anderson, the fullback there. Yeah, strong side down there as they're coached by the uh, two Walker brothers. I believe one of them plays on and off. I'm not too sure if he plays anymore, but I believe one of them does play. And uh, Kieran Landry, or, sorry, Kieran Lander, I believe is his name the lock their final match and uh, he got to put over a nice final conversion to just kick off his retirement there but yeah all in all real good match uh, Neville Costigan starring for the Blackhawks which was surprising uh, I didn't think he still played but you know I thought his old bones couldn't take it and that surprised me at least and uh, yeah proper NRL grand final coming up this weekend uh, sorry guys I've just got the gameplay um, going on in the background here short of Shorter one uh, for this episode, and you'll see why I come towards the end. But yeah, just got back from injury and ready to play. And yeah, dust off my boots here. Probably got you know the Steeden, Steeden standard boots or whatever they are. You know the forty dollars on sale from Amart boots that your mum bought you when you started footy. Doesn't matter there. As uh, yeah, here's the reason it's a shorter episode, fellas. Busted me knee. Yep, doing too much. Too much off-season, doesn't matter, man of the match, next 